A bad guy. That's how police are describing an Albuquerque man they consider a serial armed robber. Now he's facing nearly 100 charges for his crimes. News 13's Alexis Kineski explains. For the last month, Isidro Gallegos has been busy wreaking havoc all across Albuquerque. His arrest that day significantly reduced the amount of armed robberies in two separate area commands. Just one arrest. Commander Kyle Hartsock with the Albuquerque Police Department says while Gallegos was arrested March 15th on several armed robbery charges, since then police have tied him to at least 15 more. Once he was arrested, based on his description, clothing and the car he was in, our detectives came in, interviewed him, went back and pieced together those 15 other robberies that had already been reported to police. From February 5th to March 15th, he is accused of robbing gas stations, motels, businesses, and even carjacking a victim, all at gunpoint. Police say most of these crimes done in stolen vehicles. So he's stealing cars. He's stealing cars he knows are easy to steal. He's committing patterned robberies. And he's doing it over and over and over again. And the only thing that's going to stop him was us. Using different guns, even a knife. And on several occasions, police say he even fired his gun during the robberies. He is the poster child of poster children. He is a convicted felon. Uh, shouldn't have a gun at all, but did. Uh, so we're already working with our federal partners. They might adopt charges against Isidro for these crimes. And these charges are just the beginning. And by the way, we think he was involved with more. That's just what we can prove right now. But police say during several of these crimes, he had help from a woman who admitted to killing her boyfriend more than a decade ago. You what? You what? I just blew my boyfriend. Brooke Hefty pleaded no contest to involuntary manslaughter, but now she's back behind bars, arrested alongside of Gallegos for her part in several armed robberies on March 15th. For his part, Gallegos has a criminal record dating back to 2000. For these most recent armed robberies, He's facing a massive number of charges, 72 of them in this case, and a dozen more in another. Isidro is an overachiever. Uh, that's a lot of charges, but he earned every single one of them. Alexis Gineski, Care QE News 13. Gallegos is scheduled back in court later this week to see if he will be held in jail until trial.